So how to stop being a commodity and create a unique short form content offer. So you got a bunch of agency coaches, you got a bunch of people talking about the short form um, content offer, short form content opportunity. And so this is nothing new, right? For plenty of different people to sell the same thing, right? You got make a bunch of makeup artists, last text, uh, millions of water bottle brands or thousands, I don't know about millions, but the game has always been um, to stand out, right? This is why branding exists. This is why marketing exists. Um, it's all about how you communicate. So in this video, I'm gonna talk about how to communicate um, everything from top to bottom, your offer, your story. Um, we're gonna talk about your customer avatar, everything you can do to stand out to sell a uh, short form content offer that's unique to you. So um, number one, right, your customer avatar. So there's four types of clients. It's important to understand this so you know how to communicate, right? Communication is how we're going to get people to know we exist. Communication is how we're going to get people to um, buy from us, create desire for what we have. So it's important to understand who you're speaking to in your content. So um, the unaware uh, prospect, right? The person who's not aware of the problem, solution, or the offer. Right. Um, there's the person who is aware of the problem, but not aware of the solution or the offer. There's the person who's aware of the problem and the solution, but not the offer. And then there's the person who's most aware who knows of the problem, solution and the offer. Um, so, for example, right, you got the unaware prospect that doesn't know what short form content is, period. Right. So if you're trying to speak to this person, you might say something like, do you want to know how to get 100 new users for your high ticket AI business, right? You speak more about the benefit and the result they want. Right. And then we continue and say in 2023, one of the best opportunities to increase brand awareness and create new opportunities to get paid is content that can be consumed in 60 seconds or less um, via video, otherwise known as short form content. Right now you've made them aware of what short form content is. So the next time you bring it up, they're like, oh, right. It's the type of content that can be consumed in 60 seconds. It can help me get clients, right? Um, blah, blah, blah. Now, virtually any business needs short form content. So one way you can stand out is who you serve, right? If everyone's trying to serve a specific demographic, you could be like, oh, I'm going to work with SaaS companies or I'm going to work with e-learning businesses such as coaches, consultants, um, course creators and even within those niches right you got sub niches so you can work with a coach but you can specifically work with like spiritual coaches right um or intuitive coaches uh even agencies right um working with agencies there's marketing agencies modeling agencies advertising agencies i think i said advertising twice but anyway you got recruiting advertising modeling a bunch of different agencies you can um, choose to work with you got nonprofit companies right so just who you target permanent makeup artists i mean there's so many different um, niches right so who you target is one way for you to stand out right it's important again it's important to understand every business needs marketing right so don't ever think there's not an opportunity for you to get paid right no one person is gonna um completely have dominion over short form content or any sort of marketing services right number two um, choosing the right message. So it's important for you not to be another person selling editing, right? Because why would I go to you just to edit videos when I can just pay someone $600 a month from South Africa or go to like Fiverr or Upwork or something, right? So instead of saying, um, we're going to help you edit your content, you say something like, uh, we're helping you save time. So what I say specifically is we help you script, film, edit, and publish your next 210 to 280 videos in less than 10 days with only two hours of your time, right? So we're doing it fast. Um, we are helping with the scripting, right? So we're helping them what to say. We're creating like a real offer, right? Um, so you can use terms like uh, reach. We're going to help you get more reach. We're going to help you build your audience, clients. Uh, we're gonna, Sorry, we're going to help you get clients. We're going to help you build a community, help you get leads, users, profits, selling the benefit. Right, this is how you can stand out. Three, right, practicing what you preach. Right, as if you're selling a short form content offer, you should be selling short form content. Right, um, if 
one person is selling short form content, but you're they're only getting a thousand impressions, a hundred, a thousand views per video, but you're getting you know over a hundred thousand to a million impressions per month, right? That alone helps you stand out, right? Um, them seeing the way you edit your videos and them seeing the sort of engagement you get, how unique your branding is, right? Um, or them you sharing all the different sorts of content you're creating for clients, right? Show, don't tell. That's the best way for you to uh, sell an offer like this, right? Just show, right? The results they can get, show what you're doing for clients, that sort of thing. Um, building a brand is one way to increase your uh, demand and perceived value, allowing you to also charge more, right? And then lastly, we're going to talk about the offer. Um, a good offer is an offer that solves different problems. Again, right? Scripting, that's one problem. Filming, that's another problem. Editing is another problem. And then I would find that clients, even after I would create content for them, right? It's important to just launch. It's important to just start um, selling, marketing, even if you don't know how to deliver, right? And you're going to figure things out along the way. So when I initially started selling this offer, I didn't realize that publishing was going to be a problem. So I eventually learned that. And then I updated my messaging. Um, I updated my offer accordingly. So now I say we help you script, film, edit, and publish, right? And so um, you can offer creative direction, uh, done for you scripting, done with you, or done for you filming, depending on the situation. If it's a local person, you might do the uh, done for you. But if it's like online, you do done with you over like Zoom or Google Meet. Um, done for you publishing, unlimited revisions, email and tech support, anything you do, you need to um, include that in your offer, it builds the value, right? And then again, you can communicate it however you want. Um, you can literally just use different words and that makes what you're saying seem like it's different, right? So instead of saying we help you script, film, edit, and uh, publish, you say distribute. So literally, sim the simplest stuff like that can uh, make someone think they're seeing something different. Like I remember I had a marketing campaign and I was trying to sell people on the idea of advocates, right? Um, you need advocates to help you get more clients organically. And so um, advocates are, are essentially supporters, right? I literally looked up what's a synonym for supporter and that's how I found the word advocates, right? Um, another word for advocates is just an audience. You need people to sell to. So I just changed the word and it made it seem like something completely different which it was just another way of saying you need a good audience. So um, that's how you create a uh, market and sell an offer, specifically a short form content offer that stands out, but you can use that to sell whatever type of offer, um, that whole process or these frameworks that we just talked about, right? Um, selling to the right crowd, communicating through content, and then solving multiple issues, right? This is how you're gonna stand out. Just staying consistent, right? Um, you got people who are going to start the short form content thing and then give up after like a month or two because there's some other they, they want to do crypto or they want to do uh, drop shipping or whatever online making up opportunity. But for you to really get better at your craft, for you to really um, be able to start charging more, for you to be able to um, build brands, start getting inquiries more consistently, you're going to want to stay consistent. So that's the video. Um, if you want to learn more about how to actually like go about script or sorry, uh, well, yeah, delivering on a service, actually creating um, short form content, everything from scripting, filming, editing, and publishing, I have a free course below. And then um, if you want to work with me, same link, www.contentmarketingguide.com um, in the uh, description. That being said, peace.